So what's up guys hope you are doing well I'm Mesh from TechMesh and today I'm going to introduce you with a software called mini tool movie maker. So this is a free video editing software for beginners. They have paid version available but I think that their free version is also really capable of doing a lot of things that a beginner need for their video editing. So let me show you. So this is their link the link will be also available in the description below. So after coming to their link you can see there is a preview of their what their software can do this is really an easy to use and feature rich video editor and this video is sponsored by mini tool but i am giving my honest opinion about their software that how you can use it and if it is helpful or not so after coming to their website then you need to click on free download to download their software so let me click here so you can see that it has been downloaded real quick so after downloading the exe then just double click on the exe and then click on run and then press on yes and now here click on install now and that's it now just wait for a couple of seconds or minute depending on your computer and your internet speed so here you can see that our software has been installed it only took like 30 or 40 seconds so after downloading the software then you can just click on start now to start the software and let me show you that what you can do with their free version and what you can do with their other versions as well you can see that with free editions you can use all the video effects text and elements available in the mini tool movie maker you can also export your videos up to 1080p i think this is really good enough for any beginners who want to just export their videos and also in your videos there will be no watermarks so this is a really good point because in lot of free video editing software they usually add their watermark but in mini tool you can export your videos without any watermark in the free editions and in free edition you can also export three videos without any length limit and after the first three videos then you can export each videos up to two minutes afterwards and their software also works on windows 7 windows 8 8.1 10 or windows 11 and with monthly subscription of 12.99 dollar you can get a one license for one pc and also you can get one month free upgrade and you can also export videos without any length limit and in their annual subscription which is generally at $60 but in annual subscription with 40% off you can get it now for $35.99 and with it you can see that you can get one license for one PC and also you will get one year free upgrade so this is a really good deal and for, with their unlimited plan you can see that the, it generally priced at $99.99 but uh, right now there is a 40% off so you can get it for $59.99 you would get one license for three PC so now let me show you that what you can do with their free edition and if you think that it might be helpful for you then you can also upgrade to the paid version later so here you can see that this is the interface this section is for importing media and also here you can see that they have lots of transitions available you can also get lots of effects here whatever effect you need and also you can add different types of text with their animation you can see that they have a lot of varieties of options available here you can also get a lot of motion and also you can get a lot of elements and you can use all of these so there is no restriction whatsoever and there is their player so after editing a video you can see it in the player and this is at the bottom here is the timeline in timeline you can drag and drop any video so let me show you let's say if you want to import a video so just here click on media and click on import media file so so let's say for example we want to import these two videos and these two audio files so click on all of this and click on open and now you can see that our video has been imported in this media section so after importing your medias then you can also like if you want to see an preview of any media just hover your mouse over that media and then you can see the preview of what is in that particular media and if you want to import it then just click on this plus icon and it would be added to your timeline 
so after adding any media so let's say that there is like this portion of obs screen recorder that we want to delete so just here just drag this portion let's say that we want to split it exactly in this portion so we can just click on this split icon and this portion has been splitted and if you want to just delete it then just click on here and click on this delete icon and now the selected media has been deleted let's say that we want to add another media files in our timeline so let's say we want to add this one so just here click on this plus icon and you can see that the media has been added let's say that we want to cut it here so let's click on this split icon and now let's click on you can also click on this delete icon or the delete button on your keyboard also works and let's say that we want to cut it from here exactly so let's click on this split icon and let, let's click on delete again and now we want to add a transition between these two clips so you can see that this is two separate clip but we want to add a transition so just go to your transition section here and here you can see that they have lots of options available for your transition so here you can select whichever transition you like so let's select one here so let's select this one so if you want to select it just click on it and then let's drag it here and you can see that we have already added this transition effects here so if you just play play it here let's see that if we just play it here let's see here you can see that there is a smooth transition sliding transition here so here you can also see that you can also increase or decrease the duration according to your needs let's say we want to increase the duration you can also do that and you can also change the transition mode from overlap to prefix or postfix however you want let's say that we want to add a text here so just go to this text option here and here you can see that lots of text option available so you can select whichever you want so let's see that if you just hover your mouse over any of the text then you can see that how the effect will look in your video so you can select according to your needs so let's select the first one so just click on here and let's drag and drop it here so we have added the text so here you can see that with the white background you cannot see it so let's change the color of the text to black in the text editor you can just like change the text to whatever you want let's name it to how to install virtual box and if you want to also change the font of the text you can also do that let's select this one for example and you can also increase or decrease the opacity of the text and change the font size however you like so we have added the text so if you just play it you can see that this is how the text looks like and there is also their pre-built effects available with your text you can also change the position of the text to suitable location for your video let's say that let's say that we want to add it here now let's play it now you can see that there is an text with and sweet transitions in our video so you can also add different kinds of elements so here you can see that they have lots of elements available here so let's add this one like if you want to edit a video for your youtube videos then you can also like here they have pre-built subscribe one and two option so let's select the subscribe one for example so now if we just play it here so here you can see that there is a like subscribe option here and this is also animated and it looks really good let me show you if we just go back a little bit and if we just play it here you can see it is showing like and also hit the bell icon so this is really great for any beginners or you can also use it for advanced reasons as well after editing your videos then you can easily export it so to export it just click on this export icon here and now here it is showing that free edition limitation that you can export the first three videos without length limit and afterwards you can export video up to two minute in length so here you can see that there is two option one is for pc and another one is for devices like in devices you can select like iphone ipad smartphone and whatever you need and in my case i will export it for pc so i'm selecting pc and you can also select the format to according to your needs and then let's name it like to install virtual box 
you can also save it to different location and here you can see the resolution is 1080p and the frame rate is showing here and the video duration is this much and the size is this much and then you can also click on the settings icon and in the settings icon here you can see the quality so let's select the best quality because we want to get the best quality out of our video you can also select your resolution up to like 1080p and you can also select the frame rate let's select it to up to 30 and then let's click on ok and now let's click on export so here you can see that it is exporting so the export time will depend on your computer and also on your video length the higher the video length the more time it will need so that's it that's how you can edit any videos using this mini tool movie maker this is a really great software and this is really easy to use any beginners can edit their videos using this tool and also you can use it for advanced purposes as well so if you like this video then don't forget to hit the like button and also their link will be available in the description below so if you want to check them out then go to the link in the description and go check them out so that's it i'm match from tech mesh and i am signing out